evening and welcome to another exciting episode of City Vibes Metro. Thanks so much for your support and feedback. Many people who see me out and about wonder if they should approach me or talk to me. The message is yes, you should. You have a personal invitation to stop me, introduce yourself, and definitely let me know if you have a service, a product, or a story you think I should feature on my show. In fact, that's how I got to feature my first guest today on health and fitness. Dr. Jean Casello, medical director of Renovo MD, a unique medical center in Shrewsbury. Her office manager, Josephine Casello, saw me out one night and came right up to me to tell me about Renovo MD and Dr. Casello. And Dr. Casello will tell us all about the state of the art technology and non surgical treatments offered at her medical center in Shrewsbury. <laughs> Welcome back, and now I have the great pleasure of introducing Dr. Jean Casello from Renovo MD. How are you, Jean? I'm fine, thank you. Great. Well, your center, your medical center, is right on Main Street as you head into the center of Shrewsbury. So tell us how you started it. Um, we started um, about a year ago. We opened this facility, um, and probably about six or seven years ago, started getting interested in uh, the newest and latest technology uh, in terms of non-surgical cosmetic enhancement. So I started to, as I started to investigate it, I realized that I wanted to specialize in this area of medicine. And at first, one of the compelling reasons was you were helping teenagers or people with acne. So tell us how that got started. Um, well, as the mother of two teenagers, I realized how important this was to teenagers when they have a breakout or, more importantly, older uh, teens or young adults who have the scarring uh, as a result of acne that they had as teenagers. And um, I started to, I realized that we could really help these teens and these young adults with some of the laser technologies and some of the newer pharmaceuticals that we have available to us. That's great because I have two teenagers also and I know they don't have any real serious acne problem but once a little breakout happens it really affects sure. their self-esteem. Absolutely. So it's really, and, and I understand about 30 percent of your patient base are the people with acne. Yes. Um, most of the kids that come in are brought in by their parents or they're referred from other physicians who don't have the technology um, or the lasers or the pharm pharmaceuticals that we offer in our, in our uh, medical center. Great. Now, your facility is a medical facility. Yes. It's non-surgical. Exactly. And so tell us when someone walks into Renovo MD besides feeling like they went to heaven, <laughs> which is a really beautiful space Thank and the you. energy is wonderful, <laughs> the services that you offer and maybe go through a consultation, like why would someone like myself or mm -hmm. a friend want to come to you? Well, mostly we're that bridge between the salons and somebody who is contemplating surgery. Now with the technology that's out there, um, we really can do a lot that's non-surgical to enhance somebody's appearance. So as the person ages or gets a little more mature, um, the, the services that are offered in a salon are no longer um, helpful to them. So we really see that segment of the population that comes, that's kind of outgrown those services. So we're that bridge, pretty Great. much. And then I also understand that um, some, you know, more elderly men and women come to you. I, I understand that someone around 80. Absolutely. You know? We're finding, uh, which was very interesting <laughs> to me, but what we're finding is um, that there are a lot of pa uh, patients that come to us in their 70s and 80s. They're living longer, they're feeling great, they yeah. want to look good, and they're coming to us um, for these cosmetic enhancements and they don't want to undergo surgery. Right, you know what, when I first moved here, I called it the Yan Yankee, sort of Yankee mentality where you age, you know, you just age and it shows character, but more and more women come up to me and say, mm, I want to learn more about what you have to offer. Mm -hmm. So it's interesting because they look at that as just the next step of feeling rejuvenated and, you know, maybe feeling better. And also, many women and men have poor pigmentation right. just because of the sun and maybe not eating right or exactly. smoking, and so you take care of that too. Right, exactly. We, we really focus on correction. Um, we do do a lot of prevention with the, with the younger 
patients, but for the most part, the patient that comes to us needs some kind of correction, either from sun damage or just the effects of aging on the skin, and we're geared toward getting results or correcting the damage that's been done. And believe, uh, fortunately, we only have about three months of sun, but even that little bit, and prior to a few years ago, none of us were using sunblock. Absolutely. But, so, <laughs> but not only that, you give them treatment programs as well. It's not just come in and you consult with them, you find out what their lifestyle needs are, what right. they're really trying to achieve, and then you put them on some type of treatment programs. Exactly. What we do is we do a full medical consult. We talk to the patient about what it is they want to achieve and we give them a um, comprehensive and customized treatment plan as well as home care products and prescriptive plan. And talking about products, so you brought some of your products that you have tested and believe mm -hmm. in, that you recommend, and so our camera is zooming into that. And so I'm curious, you have a son who just graduated and is in college now, yes. and how did you come up with the name Renovo? Um, that was from my son um, a couple of years ago. Um, we were trying to discuss what it is that we do. What is medical aesthetics since it's a new field of medicine? And he said, Mom, you're, you want to rejuvenate and renew people. And I said, yes, that's what we're doing. And that's the Latin word. Medicine is Latin, uh, the Latin word for rejuvenation and renewal. So that's, that's how we came up with it. Renova. Wow, that's great. Well, good. It's great to have uh, children that are almost <laughs> as smart as we are, or even smarter. Can you exactly. imagine? We'll, well, and then you're in, let's just tell quickly our audience that you're in Shrewsbury. Tell them the address. I know it's popping up. Right. Um, we're in Shrewsbury um, on 512 Main Street, um, right near the center of town. And you can, they can call and have a consultation with you? Absolutely. Everybody right. that comes into the office gets a full consultation with myself, yes. Right. And meet Josephine. And meet Josephine. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks very much, and we'll be right back. The Hanover Theatre for the Performing Arts presents the 2009-2010 Broadway series. The Wizard of Oz. Legally Blonde. A Chorus Line. River Dance. Beauty and the Beast. Cirque Dreams Illumination. A Christmas Carol. Five, six, seven, eight! Experience the new Worcester at the Hanover Theatre. Dining Out Metro West, the most delicious hour on the air, with your hosts Christina Andrianopoulos and Alan Eisenberg. Tune in each week on Saturdays at 5 p.m. and Sundays 6 p.m. on WCRN Radio AM 30 to learn about the many restaurants, new menus, top chefs, and all the happenings in Worcester and Worcester County. Don't miss out. Stay in touch with the culinary experiences in our city.